New tonight at 10, several people in Madison are calling on the mayor and city council to keep Madison as the regional identifier for the new baseball team. Fears over the city name not being included started when Ball Corp, who owns the team, released the Name the Team vote, where people have the option of choosing Rocket City, North Alabama, or Madison. WE31'S Cody Fisher joins us live after talking to people who are passionate about the team name, and he's finding out what happens if the team doesn't have Madison in the name. Cody? Dan, everyone at home still has three days to vote for what they want the team to be called, and that team is going to be playing under the bright lights of a brand new stadium that this equipment right behind me here is currently laying the foundation for. And come Friday, we'll actually know the top five team names that people have voted for so far. Greg Rivera and his family have lived in Madison for 19 years. I'm not a big fan of, of any of the names, but. It would definitely be Madison first. His biggest problem with the regional identifiers is the Rocket City choice, which he says is what Huntsville, not Madison, is known for. To use the nickname of another city for what is the premier investment of this community is just, it's just wrong. Mayor Finley says he's just enjoying the naming process and trying to keep an open mind about what the team will eventually be called. I'm not as caught up as I am as some are on Madison because we, in turn, in generating the most excitement and revenue, want the most buy-in that we can get. The only way Madison won't be in the name is if the city council votes to take that requirement out of the contract. If Madison is not in the name, the city will pay less in utilities for the multi-use venue. But the rate would change from 60-40 to 75-25. The biggest fear for some about the outcome of the team name is the contest itself. That vote is open to everybody. It's not open to just the people who are paying the investment. Which is what it boils down to for some. Madison is going to front the bill for the team and, and pay the investment for the team, then it should be Madison should be in the name. The city of Madison says one simple way to ensure that Madison is actually in the team name is to participate in the Name the Team competition online. Now, uh, when the final five uh, names, team names are announced on Friday, we'll let all of you at home know what they are, and then that will actually start a new uh, competition, a new voting period, and then a final team name will be announced after that. Reporting live in Madison, Cody Fisher, Way 31 News.